Hello everyone, welcome back to some more RimWorld Alpha 14. Last episode we ended off with an infestation. We got rid of the hive. All our people are basically injured, but not actually any new permanent injuries or anything like that, which is good. Because I like my people to be alive. We are going to get Defo to treat Engie. Because that's obviously best for us. Marat is going to go stargazing. Because of reasons. Kai is giving up and going to bed. I don't blame him. You have been treated for everything. That's good. We'll wake Defo up as soon as uh, Marat gets back. There we go. You still need a bunch of treatment. And then we'll be fine. People are... In pain. Murat's got an infection in his torso. Oh dear. We need to treat that with medicine. Do we have any? 11. It's not bad. Right, let's keep an eye on it then. We're gonna treat the bite and the... Yeah, we're gonna treat the two bleeding wounds first. And then we start treating the infection. At which point... An eclipse happens. Treat Marat. We want to get you as high a treatment quality as we can to build up that immunity. It's not bad, but it should suffice for now. We'll get you into bed. You can eat, that way you'll build up immunity faster as well. And at this point we need to get another door in here because they sort of removed our door. Thankfully, NG is on the case. We did drop our sniper rifle, but... We had to do it in order to get the assault rifle so that NG could have a better shot at people. Thankfully, we had a party last episode before everything went to hell. So, people are still relatively happy. Even if they're a bit injured right now. Battered and bruised, but not dead, which is the important part. We'll be able to clean this place up again. Get rid of the ugliness and all that. NG, meanwhile, is still smoothing out floors, getting us four extra beauty per tile, a little bit of extra movement speed as well, and altogether just making this a better place to be. That's better. Beauty is within acceptable limits again. And ever so slowly going up. Right, meanwhile, major infection, 44%. Treatment's about to run out, so let's. Actually make sure that you get enough treatment, Marat. And as high quality as possible. There we go, prioritize treating. Use more medicine. Again, we want to try and get that immunity as high as possible before it gets to extreme. There we go, 50% treatment quality should be enough. Hopefully. I just don't want Marat to die. We need all the people we can get right now. Even though there might not be too many. Still smoothing out the floors, that's alright. We... What we could do is mine out some of the, the walls, but as it stands, we need some stone cutting done. Do it until we have a thousand. Just do anything. There we go. It's actually pretty hot inside now, which is good. Anyone? Oh yeah, Engie. You're a decent crafter. That's good. We need some decent crafting right now. Then we'll be able to start making this out of actual walls. Which is always nice. Cargo pods have landed. They dropped us some metal and some plasteel. A chunk of spacecraft landed nearby. Sweet! That is 16 more components. It's quite far away though. There's also a boar here that we can grab. Thankfully, bodies don't decompose right now because it's frozen outside. Murat has a severe illness. 82%, so provided we give him proper treatment, he should be okay. He should be okay. He should be alive at the end of all this. Research is a bit slow right now. Because of everything that happened. We are walking all the way over there to get that boar. It's a bit far if you ask me, but I get it. 
Of course, Davo is the one that wanted over. Murat is being treated by NG instead. 95%, we should be okay. The, the warning only just popped up, so... I think we just managed to save Murat's life with that. And you are level 6 now, and it's great. Better medicine for everyone. Eclipse is over. We're harvesting some wood for once. LMG is still slowly decomposing. We might just want to disassemble it at some point. Just be like, yep, we are going to build some new stuff now. Rat's no longer incapable of walking. That's great. Defo needs his treatment for his gut worms. Fair enough, I suppose. What I think we'll do is we'll mine out that bar, that bit. And then once we start building ourselves some stone chunks, we'll start building a permanent stone wall over here. I don't want to use wooden walls for too long because wooden walls tend to f burn. Which is annoying. We've got Kai just doing some mining. Just hammering away at the rocks while everyone's trying to sleep. I don't think they like it very much, but they don't have a choice. This allowed sewing, which is useful. Angie is still smoothing all the floors. You've learned your max today. Ooh. Psychic wave. Many of the elk have been driven insane. Oh my. So yeah, they have put a cap on how much skill you can learn daily. So, Angie doesn't quite learn as fast now. Unfortunately, we are about to get attacked by a bunch of elk. What we're quickly gonna do is we're gonna get everyone up in arms. Literally everyone. Then we're gonna defend our honor. And lives. So where did the mad animals happen? It's only two, we should be able to manage that. Quickly run over there. Because they are smart, you know. They are kind enough to literally run in and die. Over the marsh, which is basically the most unprotected area. As in they have no cover. I can do words. We're getting quite a bit of firing practice while we're out here. So that's cool. Thanks guys. The elk are dead. A lot of hits have been made. Experience has been earned. It's great. We might have to make a better bedroom at some point. We're paying respects to Tony here. How's your joy doing? Quite good. Tons of joy, in fact. You still have that cap? No, you, you don't anymore. Part is smoothing. There we go. Just go do stuff. And you're going straight back into bed. I mean, that's fair enough. I did sort of disturb you there. A group of travelers from Camino Brixo are passing by. Hi. Cooking is still awful. Wish we had a good cook. That would have really helped us. Unfortunately, Kai is quite bad at it as well. Davo just lost an arm and is not going to get one back anytime soon either. We'll cut some more trees down because we need more. Honestly, more pines would be great. There's a dead Ibex though there that we can grab, probably. We have taken apart those spaceship chunks, I think, which is great. More components. We have 94 components. Wow. We didn't start with any, but we sure as hell got a bunch. That's great. Love it. Still training construction quite well. I wish you could tell people like, hey, once you're done doing the maximum amount of like XP earning, go do something else. I think the skill cap also differs for like construction and shooting and things like that. Which is useful. But yeah, construction 11. That's great. This is getting a lot more beautiful as well, I think. Yeah, the beauty is nearly at pleasant environment instead of ugly. Which is great. 
And then soon we'll put things over here for Joy, for example. We can go over to the chess table. And we'll put some down furniture, get some wooden dining chairs. A defector named Tycho Cabrera calls you from nearby. She's being chased by pirates from the Manic Alligators. She begs for safety and offers to join you, and she is 61 years old. Ah, she's Marat's sister. We'll have to do it now. I would have declined otherwise, but we'll offer safety. Please don't be terrible, please don't be terrible, please don't be terrible, please don't be terrible, please don't be terrible. Stab Scar. Nervous Jogger. Well, you're not that awful, I suppose. You can do some cooking for us, although you're not that bad, uh, that good. You do have a decent shooting skill, though. I might have you be our sniper. So you're not that awful, you can stay, congratulations. Now we're gonna have to face retribution, unfortunately. A bunch of personal shields, excellent. Right, how... Well, you should be able to move pretty quickly, actually. Form up the shooting gallery, because of course... Might as well enjoy such a spectacle. Spread people out a little bit. Yeah, look at that walking speed. And then Marsh. Thankfully, everyone's like, yeah, we're gonna use the wall for cover. Psych! Mm. Oh, actually, at this point, go for the LMG. And there's cargo pods landing over there. Keep that in mind, as these people charge us to die. Psycho, you might be able to help out in this fight. This is why I love personal shield. We're safe from retribution. Or at least, we're safe from friendly fire for once. Although, at this point, Davo might want to flee. Davo, please! And he's down again. Thankfully, no new injuries. A lot of friendly fire. Please don't die. Guys, no freaking friendly fire, come on. Well, this is gonna be bad. They are fleeing, thankfully. Nobody died. But that was terrible. We're gonna have to rescue people right away. Start hauling all their weapons inside. That's a good plastic knife. Sorry, Kai, we'll be back. I mean, we do have another person now, which is helpful. At the cost of... Well... This is not too great medicine-wise. I'm not gonna lie. If we get more infections, we're doomed. We're gonna get another zone in here. Temporarily. We're just gonna make this a weapon stockpile. Clear all. Allow weapons. Then we'll haul the weapons out of here. And we're gonna need you to do some treatment. Just close up the wounds. We still don't have one great doctor. The one we do have is incapacitated. Yeah, you need to go and rescue Kai, please. So, another person, which is nice, even though the moods are not too great. Rats no longer incapable of walking. I'm more worried about Defo, since he's our actual medic. I think I'm gonna get Tycho to do some runs to get the weapons. If we can keep them in high quality, that would be great. So we'll start holding the assault rifle. Is Kai bleeding? Yes, he is. Rat should be okay. I want to treat Kai now, just to make sure that Kai doesn't bleed out. I mean, slowly but surely, Angie is becoming a reliable second medic. As in, at some point, you'll have to do so much medicine, you will get decent at the skill. Right, Defo is no longer incapable of walking, so immediately start getting him to treat Marat. Again, we want to hold the Plasteel Gladius, if we can. It's got more DPS. 
rats are getting better substantial treatment now. Hypothermia on Tycho. I want to haul the Plasteel Club as well, and then the Plasteel Knife, because it has some... It has a good market value. You have serious hypothermia. And a stab scar. Inside, it's zero degrees. We actually managed to get it to minus 45 over there, wow. I'm sort of amazed right now. Tycho is in a mental break, dazed. Please, get warmer. We're trying to heat this up over here, but it's not working. It's minus 20 outside, for crying out loud. Kai's gotten sick from infection. We'll grab the medicine. Protest treating. I like how Tycho's like, I'm gonna strip naked after suffering from hypothermia. That's not how it works, Tycho. That's not how it works. Uh, Marat, just get an assault rifle. Psychic drone. Of course a psychic drone over all our females. That's precisely what we needed. Yeah, things are not going perfectly. I'm not gonna lie. Tycho's no longer in a day state. That's good. Wear your shirt and pants. Right, there's no more hypothermia. Hold a good knife. It's just a random caribou over there. Hi, caribou! How do you carry do? Meanwhile, it's starting to snow. It took long enough, actually. Thought it would have happened quite a bit sooner. So, with it being the 15th of fall, I think there's only one thing we can... Oh, God! The pigs have arrived! Thankfully, they're crap, except for their charge rifle. Well, Tycho's not going to be joining us in this. I mean, of course you are, but still. They're also not. Where? There's the plastic gladius, alright. I want to keep Kai in bed. You guys are going to go over there. They're following the classic strategy of failure. Failure, there we go, words. Please don't mentally break. Davo's gonna be distracting the firing, that's good. Their charge rifle guy is heavily injured already. Tycho is fully healed. All the fire is going to Davo, which is good. Even some friendly fire. Crush his personal shield, that's good, and please kill him. They're fleeing, that's good. We should be able to finish them. Or at least Peter. We'll chase Squirrel, why not? We're gonna tell Tycho to stop being there. There's a bunch more stuff we now have. Some medicine, which will be helpful. We'll have to treat Davo again. You are definitely dying. An, a teetotaling optimist, incapable of intellectual and crafting. We'll capture you, I guess. Kill that guy, because why the hell not? Actually, I'd like you to... Hold up medicine! Yes. I think what we'll do is we'll try to place a door over here and make this our prisoner room. We'll see if that works. There's a lot of screaming happening outside. Children. <laughs> oh well, winter has officially begun. Davo has gotten his treatment. Rat's eating. Kai, how's your health? 45%. We're gonna get Davo to do some treatment then. And you should be fine. A chunk of spacecraft has fallen again. 
That's going to be 24 more components, as well as a bunch of steel. We have a million components this game. It's like the stellar opposite of what usually happens. It's great. NG, I'd like you to build that wooden door for me. And then we can maybe see about capturing Mac. Capture the Luddite. That charge rifle is poor, but it still, it still fetches a pretty penny. So we'll haul a couple of more weapons. Severe illness on Mac. That would be blood loss. I don't think he's going to make it, quite frankly. Cheering up Kai. Um, can you take over medical in here instead? Feed Kai some berries, yes. And Mac has died because of blood loss. Well, at least we don't have to haul his parts too far. God, we need to ditch these bodies again. People are going to get so unhappy when seeing all that. A group of huskies, abandoned or joined, have wandered into the area. They seem accustomed to human contact and have joined the area and the colony. Sweet! And they're instantly dogging. <coughs> well, that's how it goes. We now have a bunch of animals. We'll have to train them in obedience. And hauling. Sweet. Assign them to the home area, though. And while I'm going places. Sweet. This is great. Like, legitimately good. We're getting places now. But anyway, I think we've been going on for long enough for this episode. If you enjoyed the video, then please do leave a like down below. It really does help the channel out a lot. Leave a comment if you have anything to say. And if you want to see more, then why not subscribe? Anyway, until next time. Have a good one, folks.